Hey everybody, Midnight here. Welcome back to Mega Aquarium Freshwater Friendship. Romero has leveled up. Let's get that fixing up. Anna has leveled up. Feeding fixing. Ugh. Is it better to be a jack of all trades or master of one? I don't know. Uh, we've nearly done this one, actually. So, I don't know how this is going to affect this video. Obviously, it would be boring to make a 10-minute video of, hey, I just finished this scenario. But at the same time, if it's done, it's done. But we'll see how it goes. Um, I don't know how I want this to go. They look out of place now. I thought... Uh, yeah, okay. I was like, they should have a belt on them. But I guess the belt is on the, on the wooden, like fixing thing. I see you're still going up now. 3,421. So that's good. I've obviously... Malik. Oh no. Those of you that's played Knights of the Old Republic, one of the greatest games ever. If you've not played it, I recommend it even now. Bruh. Looks stressed. Why are you stressed, my friend? It don't look stressed. Unless you're talking about this thing. You don't look stressed. Nobody's stressed here, my guy. Nobody's stressed. Alright, so we need just over 50. So we need one big build. Which... I know I just expanded this area. And I feel like it was a waste. But I think I can save it. I think I can save it. Alright, I'll be back when I've saved this. I was just looking at these nurse sharks. I wondered if I could put them in there, but I think 110 after 24 days would be really pushing that. Really pushing that limits. 150. They grow quite big, so that's 35. But they need a tank of at least 210 when fully grown. Oh, is that 210? Let's not worry about it. Let's just put our fingers in our ears and it'll be fine. Uh, so we could put more sharks down. This could be like a shark area. That means I'd have to expand this out just a little bit more. Just a little bit more. Because sharks... I'd prefer it if sharks had a big tank. Um, I'm actually going to remodel the entirety of this. Including these. He's mad, I can hear you saying. Yep. Yep, yep. Uh, where's that? We could put that there like that. And they are quite big, so... 225. Not enough money. How much is it? Oh, it's nearly three grand. I think for the benefit of completing this scenario, we still can't even afford that. Yikes. I expanded too much. All right, back when we've uh, got some monies. Somebody here is stressed. Not got a 3-3 three, three space. No. How he not got a 3-3? Three, 3-3 three, three, three space is massive. Probably that. Probably this. We put that there. That should fix it. There we go. Fix it. Fixed it. We might not actually need these sharks to get this scenario done, to be honest. It's a bit of a struggle at the minute. Right, we got the three grand for the tank. I might just pop the tank in for now. Oh shoot, they can't be they can't be fed because of my little mess up. That's fine. It's fine. We'll be able to fix... Can we fix it with... It can't be that much to build these platforms, surely. And then some steps. There you go. They can be fed now. And then we'll put a pump in here that will do that. And then it can be easy claps in the chat. 
Sonario done. GG easy. So we've got enough for a pump. Do I do I pause it here and set um, no let's not sell that yet because if we sell that I was going to sell that and put this in which would make sense but I don't want to jeopardize them sharks just yet so I'm going to connect that to that And then I'm actually going to, I don't want to jeopardize it, but now I like kind of am. Actually, no, I'm not. I'm going to just disconnect that one. And now that'll do for now. And then when we got a bit more money, we can actually hook that up and it'll all be good. Bing Ray has grown. That's grown again. Ugh. Another stingray is pretty good. This thing must be huge now. It literally takes up the entire, takes up the entire tank. We get that in like first person view. It literally takes up the entire tank. It takes up everything. I made a slight error putting that in there. When I say a slight error, I mean a huge error. Mate, you might want to use the toilet that's just near. Up the coat is feeding skill. Have we... Hey, we've won it. Nice. I didn't see that one coming at all. I was just about to sell the, the thing. But a manatee, let's go. There's a, You can't see, but on my um, shelf behind me, there's a little manatee that I got from SeaWorld. You did it. Kairobi's collection is now bursting with animals. Each one expertly sourced and bred by, all bred by yourself. It's time for your final challenge. You are to build a brand new aquarium in Diamond River, the home of the American manatee. Sweet, I can't wait. I love manatees. They're just like so chill. You can continue to build here in Kairobi or we can go when we want. And um, just before we do go, I am going to just trade. Oh, Sven has leveled up. Your priority was fixing. I'm just going to sell one of these. We've got some more seahorses. Not that we're going to plonk them down anywhere. Can we get them in there, do you think? 16 out of 42. Let's drop them in there. Oh, no, they... Oh, no, are they... No, we've messed up. we messed up. They're not... They're a chilly uh... seahorse. Well... This has gone horribly wrong right at the end. We love to see it. There's actually nowhere I can put them as though. Because I'll probably get eaten by stuffs. We love to see it go horribly wrong right at the end. Alright, we fix this mess before we go. We actually fix this mess before we go. I'd feel really bad if... They died. Because of my stupidity. Actually, I've changed my mind. I'm going to move that. We're going to move this bench to here. Sorry, person in the cap. Then we're going to move this to here. And then I'm going to slightly expand this. It looks weird. But it's fine right now. I'm going to drop in a pump. I'm going to drop a pump here. Connect it up to that. A little chiller in the corner here. And then we need 75 on the... Black drop in there. 75 on that. And then we need some other... Food that I've not seen before. 
the, the shrimp. That can drop in there. And then I know there's some zooplankton, but there we go. There we go. Oh, we just need some decorations. No, wait, that's only 10. Got to be some de better decorations than that. 14, no! Let's sell this one then. Tank's too small. Unless we did that one. That'd be a 9. Probably better. Uh, let's sell that. There we go. And then we can sell that. Oh no, that's only seven, isn't it? Oh, I'm sawing it. The tanks are actually too small. That'll have to do. We're not worried about how we're going to start the next one, so let's check out Diamond River. Build an aquarium fit for a manatee. You'll find a freshwater challenge. Build a brand new aquarium to prove that you have what it takes to look after a full grown American manatee. Don't we need like a full on swamp for that? You have a long road ahead. First, you need to work your way up the ranks using every freshwater animal at your disposal. As an added test, you're to obtain and breed a set of hybrid discus known in equal parts for their exotic beauty and challenging breeding requirements. You have access to ecology and science projects across a range of ranks. Consider tackling projects from earlier ranks first as you'll be able to complete these quicker. After you have accomplished the current set of objectives, you will be ready to build the ultimate manatee habitat. Good luck. Um, I'm just looking at the side missions. 29 freshwater species. Breathe three different discus. Breathe three different patterned. Sorry, four different patterned discus. We need to breed. And then reach rank 12 of 6,600 prestige. Okay. So it looks like an interesting area. We can definitely work with this. Um, what have we. Large legged hermit crab. That's what we like to see. What have we got in terms of livestock? Oh, we've got a, 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 oh, an eel. A green moray eel. That's definitely going in at some point. Uh, in terms of freshwater, we've got, oh, the guppies are back. The thick lad is back as well, the pachu. And then in terms, oh, hello, turbots. <laughs> Flatfish, bro, they are weird. They are weird. Air. Just look at its face. I'm going to build one of them and just zoom in on its face because they're weird to look at. And a crab, a pie crust crab. Cool. Where do we start? Good question. Good question. Um, for a start, I think we're going to put facilities in here. I know that's an odd thing to start with, but... It will become clear in a moment why I'm starting with that. I'm actually going to shift these across one. And then a bench. There and there. Right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this as like a staff area again. I'm going to put some small... Hold on a second. Some small freestanding tanks. Okay, so they are literally only three wide. Okay. If they are three wide... There are three. Oh, we could use wall tanks, to be honest. I don't need big ones, though, because we're going to have, like, small... Like we did in the other scenario, where we had a few, like... Like, three different tanks all across here. And then it's going to be backed up by this whole area for staff. So, do they need to be that wide? We could go that long, actually. 15... 23, 30, okay. So, 
That three. 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 That's going to be cropped to be a thick lad. That's a scavenger, so that needs something in it to eat from enemies. Okay. We can actually... We can, uh, we can actually do that, then. We could go... We could just go three. One there. One there. One there like that. Then we can put... Three of them in there. What does this say? Dislikes. Can't be housed with dotty backs, grammars, or Athenias. Okay, so they've got to be on their own. That's fine. These are probably the same. Dislikes food competitors. Can't be housed with others that eat krill. Troll. It needs to be at least seven. <laughs> Imagine. Okay. You can go in there. This tank then can be sold seven seven threes was that so it needs to be 21 that's fine we can just do that we like it when it's easy one two three four five six seven easy oh this one needs a a nine a nine cave oh it's not caves it's rocks you fool these are rocky boys. So all that's going to be is just rocks. Nah, I saved it. I saved it. One bit of greenery. One bit of greenery saved it. I don't like putting um, the clownfish without some sort of... Oh, we could do that, actually. Without some sort of an enemy, you know? So I was just looking at their their um, rates for. No, I didn't want that one. For filtration, I was like, that's a bit weird. They should just need some heating. They don't grow up, so GGs on that one. Sorted. They want orange foods. that in there we can sort this one out this one wants purple foods I might actually put another pump down and then this can cover the next tank that goes in probably a good idea it'll have to be I, th I think I'm gonna put a small one in Just because it'll make it easier to keep hold of. So I forgot what I was doing then. I need krill. Krill is a sh wait, it's a shrimp, is it? But it was like some sort of amoeba thing. What do I know about fish? On the plus side, this game's taught me quite a bit about fish, actually. I knew fish were kind of savage, but I didn't realise how savage. Okay, that's a good start. That is a good start. The next question is, what are we putting next? They have to be, they have to be tropical, don't they? Oh, we could put an eel in, to be fair. 28. 28 after 12 days. We could put one of them in. Don't dislike that. So if we put two in, it'd be it'd be fifty six. If we just put two in, let's 
Let's just put two in. I don't know how this is going to work. I hope this works right. In goes the eel. Just looks like... <laughs> it's, it's in seahorse pose at the minute. It's in seahorse pose right now. Interesting. Let's sort the heating out first. They're going to want to grow up, so I'm probably going to put that in. It's not enough heat in. I knew that. It needs more filtration. Predictable. And then we need some steps. And then there should be a gap around that. There is a gap around that. Nice. And some caves. He wants 14, so we could put a big cave in there. And then maybe... One there, and then put some good old-fashioned kelp in there. Give it something to swim around in. Cool, and that is going to be the beginning. We can have a staff door there, actually. We'll staff door there. We've got no staff at the minute. I need to make sure I get some staff. Put that in there, and then we just need the food. Is herring. Um, good question. Where is that going? Probably in there. Then what I'm going to do as well is broom stand, sponge sink, tool station. We don't need that stuff yet. I shall... Hmm. I could actually put that. Let me change my mind. As long as we've got a gap there, that's fine. Put that there, and then maybe down there, put some backpacks and stuff. Could actually move this. You only move one step forward, though, and I don't want to move it one step forward. We do have this space to put stuff in as well, so as long as I've got an area to feed. But we can also expand it this way, so we can change that. We've got a lot of stuff there to, that we can do, so... That's a good start. Right, I'm not going to open yet, but what I am going to do is ask you, if you have enjoyed the video, do consider subscribing to the channel. We're on the final step of the uh, Mega Aquarium playthrough, so if you have enjoyed it, do consider subscribing. Pop a like on the video to help with the YouTube hour and stuff. There's a link down below to my Twitch. If you want to see me play games live, I play Planet Coaster at the weekend, so if you're into Mega Aquarium, you might like Planet Coaster. If you don't know what that is, it's a roller coaster, or oh, theme park management. I think everyone knows what it is. Roller Coaster Tycoon. I think, I think it's the same devs. Well, not the same devs, but I think it's a section of devs that worked on them both. Anyway, I'll see you in the next video. Have a good rest of the day. Cheerio!